Hi guys and welcome back to Vlogmas Day 6. Yeah, so it's not morning time, it's afternoon. I look a hot mess because it's my day off and this is what we're going to have the day because I'm not getting ready. But I wanted to show you what I've been up to, so one second. Alright, so I've been working on the coffee slash I'm turning it into a ho hot cocoa for like Christmas. Hopefully it'll focus. There we go. Alright, so I added this sign that I found at Hobby Lobby. And then if we go down, you have the hot cocoa box came from Hobby Lobby. Those little like stirring sticks came from Target. And these containers here all came from the Dollar Tree. Got it before they went up to $1.25 or $1.20. They're really good. I bought extras actually because these would be really good for like party events and stuff. So I got some of those. Then I moved my coffee pods and my tall uh, spoons down there. And then I've added my first piece of Christmas ray done out and about. And then I have this sign from Hobby Lobby as well just to add. I think what I want to do just because it would make life a little easier is over in this corner put a cute little garbage pail. But I want to find either like a Ray Dunn one or one that's like really cute. doesn't really look like a garbage pail. I like to put Keurig cups and stuff. So I need to do a lot of cleaning and a lot of organizing and a lot of decorating on my day off. But I wanted to show you a few like things real quick that I got from, there's a guy, sorry, ignore this, like this is why I got a clone. Um, <clears throat> like this is real me. So I have a lady, or it's a lady and guy, they're a married couple that sell Ray Dunn on Facebook and they like travel around and like pick it up because the local TJ Maxx is okay. But anyway, this is a piece that I bought from her, the Santa's Cookie Exchange. When loving this piece. Not sure where I'm gonna put it up yet, but it's gonna go somewhere. Then, I've also been doing laundry today. I took off the sheets and all that, and I'm gonna put on these sheets in the master bedroom with the little trucks, and they say Mary on them, and I think they'll look so good with my buffalo plaid bedspread and then the buffalo plaid Christmas tree. The one in the kitchen, of course, or living room is black and white buffalo plaid. The one in the bedroom, though, is red, <laughs> so, um, I may be a little obsessed with buffalo plaid. There may need to be some intervention, but you know. Ooh, I also got stockings. So they say Mary and blessed. I'm not 100% sure where I'm going to put these yet. I need to figure that out. Like I don't have like stocking hangers. I don't have, looking around, like, hmm, I'm not sure yet but I couldn't pass them up when I saw them on her page. I was like, oh, I need these. So I'm not sure where they're gonna go yet, but they're gonna go somewhere in the living room since they go with the buffalo, buffalo, what is that? The buffalo plaid that's going on in there. So I'll figure that out, but I'm not really sure yet where. So and that was pretty much it. Save this paper for packing later. That I got from my Ray Dunn friend. So I'm gonna do some dishes. I made these like time lapse with you guys. Um, and I will see you guys in a bit. All right, I've been decorating all day long. I have a few things that I want to show you guys. So hold on a second. I have added a few things to this shelf. Well, just one thing actually. I added that little tassel reindeer thing. I thought that was really cute. And let's walk over here. I did this shelf right here like a santa themed shelf and then i found a place for the two stockings i also did the porch but it's kind of chilly so i'm not going to take you out there and show you guys but let's go look at the bedroom tree all right guys so this is how the tree in the bedroom has turned out that skirt is way too big ignore it that's like the box of stuff I think this skirt's way too big, but I really don't care because I love it. It's a really done skirt. I do feel like the tree needs more ornaments. I made this bow. Right there. But I feel like it needs more ornaments. Like, let me turn the lights out. Boop. I think like that you can tell that it probably needs some more ornaments. 
What do you think? Like, I feel like it does. I feel like it just has some sparsy areas that I could fill in. And there's my heifer. But yeah. And let me show you my bed sheets. These are my bed sheets. Aren't they so cute? They say Merry Christmas on them and have a little car with a tree. I just think they're adorable. I'm not done making my bed, but there it is. <laughs> I'm about to put the pillows on here and make it all pretty. The blanket for mommy. Oop, there he is. <laughs> all right. All right. Excuse me, outfit guys. This is what I've been uh, decorating in. All right, guys. Which one do we want to do first? Walmart wanted yes. All right. It's bad. I gotta start counting the days. We need day six. Ooh, I found it pretty fast tonight. Oh, it seems like there's lots in there. Uh oh. Wanna say hi to you guys as fans? Everybody thinks you're cute. You're like, not. Nah. Oh, it's just one. Okay. Ooh, sit. Good job. All right. Ooh. Are you okay? <laughs> you're gonna have compassion by the time we're done doing this. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Day six. Day six. Oh, just one again. Just one again. Are right, you wanna sing today? Here you go. Ah. Oh, you want to sing? Let's hear it. Say hi. Oh. <laughs> so singing. Sit. All right. Good job. All right, guys. So we're going to leave you here. I hope y'all have a wonderful evening, and I'll see you for day seven.